and we also have names for people we call them Bobaloi. Bobaloi. You see, we cast, we name children on the eighth day. So when a child dies on the first day, second day, fourth day, up to seventh day, we believe the child has not come to stay. The child has not come to life at all. So when the second bone comes and it also dies, the third bone is a bobalo. The third, fourth, fifth bone are bobalo. So when that child is born, a family, the, the mother will take the child and dump the child at a junction in a bush. And a family member will pretend like he's walking uh, somewhere and comes across the child. So uh, the family member will start shouting that I have found uh, a gold, I have found a gift. So the family member will carry the child home. When that child is brought home, it is given a funny names like Obaya, you will soon go. Bubalo, uh, Obaya, or Owade, um, uh, um, property of uh, the death, the, the, the death, death property. Uh -huh. uh, and we have another, you see, we give them funny names. Another names like uh, Onidin, Obegbe, you don't have name. And uh, we have another name like uh, I'm tired, I'm tired. So we call them Bobaloi. We give them funny names. Even some of the children are named after some fishes or some, some things uh, which is not relevant. And the reason is, we believe when you give them attractive names or family names, death, it will attract death. And death will soon come and take the child away. And one strange thing is that when these children are given these names, these names, they stay. And uh, we mark the children. We give them three marks. Three marks uh, at the tip of the eye here. Another three marks here. And we give them another three at the tip of the mouth. Another three here. Like uh, the, the feet of the fowl. Mark like that. So whenever you see somebody with that facial mark, then that person is a bobalo. Which means some people have come before that person at childbirth. He has senior brothers or sisters who have passed away. So we call them Bobalo. And we also have names for the days. We guns, we don't name Kojo Kwesi and Kwatin and Adjua Amba as the Akan's name. But some of our forefathers or our fathers, they married five, six, or ten women, or even two women. So when he brings forth the first wife, Ajay, second wife, Ajay, third wife, Ajay. We, we have to identify them. So the day on which you were born is added to the Ajay. So you are either called Ajay Kojo, Ajay Kwashi, Ajay, uh, uh, Ajay Kwami. Hmm? But everybody called Kwami or Kwashi in our Ghan society has a family name. So we use it to identify the, uh, sometimes to, we, we use it to identify the type of, because when they are in the house and you are calling Ajay, there are three Ajays, so who will respond? But, so you have to say Ajay Kujo, Ajay Kwami. Uh -huh. And when it is a female to Atre, uh, uh, Atre Akoshia, Atre um, Ajua, so we don't give this, I mean, we don't have names for this in our distance, but when it comes to that, and we also have names relating to where they, uh, your mother comes from. You see, some of our fathers who married different women from different towns, when they mention Soa or Ajete, then they add Ajete London, Ajete Osu, which means your mother came from London before she was married. Your mother came from Osu because there's already somebody there, a woman was there. So that woman has a child who has similar name to yours. So we add where you come from, or sometimes the profession of the mother or the father. So we have Ajete Songbe. Ajete also, we also use description. The Ajete, Ajete Tuku, Ajete Agbo. Even our great Akra regional minister is called Afote Agbo. Agbo. The father married different women. But he is a, a giant. When you see him, he's a giant. Agbo is big. So uh, he's called Afote Agbo. He has the, another brother called Afote by the same father. So that Agbo is used to differentiate. And we also use height. Ajete Kakada, Ajete Kakada, Ajete Tuku, and we use seniority too. Ajete Nupa, Ajete Fio, Ajete Te. Yeah, so that is our naming uh, pattern, Wigans.
So we have diff these different types of names. Names for twins, uh, family names, names for Gobalo, those who die this thing, names for orphans, and names for, I mean, uh, sequential names. So these are the different types of names we have in our Ghana culture in the greater Accra region of Ghana. Thank you very much.